Garrison. Attention. Right. Morning, sir. <laughs> Civilians, where the civilian workforce are here. Yeah. Oh. There they are. Awesome. Awesome. Team Mead in every way. Okay, before we kick off this morning, do want to take first a 
moment of silence and remember the events that happened 14 years ago on this day. So let's take a quick moment of silence. Okay, thank you. Oh, uh, General Bremler, General Zabel, General Hubbard, other senior leaders, general officers that are out here, senior leaders, friends, family members, service members, team me. Thank you for being out here today in this beautiful day. Oh. Oh. So today we come together in remembrance, remembering the events that took place, the horrific events that took place on this day 14 years ago. But today we come here together not to remember out of sadness, but to remember out of the need to remain vigilant as a reminder to ourselves every day that the world is a dangerous place, that there are those out there that would seek to do our great nation harm, and that we must remain vigilant every day in our nation's defense to prevent another tragedy from occurring. In order to remain vigilant, we have to be ready. We have to stand ready as a team 24 hours a day, seven days a week, to prepared to defend our nation. Defending our nation 24 hours a day, seven days a week, in the domain of cyberspace, particularly here on this great place, and in all of the domains of human conflict and competition, air, sea, land, and space. So we must be ready 24 hours a day, seven days a week, to defend our nation, to prevent another horrific event from happening. In order to be ready, we have got to be resilient. We have got to be able to handle the adversity that life throws in front of us every day to sustain readiness. We must be resilient. We must overcome adversity. And in order to be resilient, you have to care. You got to care about yourself. You got to care about the people you work with your battle buddy, your wingman. Caring means reaching out to your battle buddy, to your wingman, and putting an arm around them when they are in a time of need. Caring means having the courage to ask, to know your battle buddies well enough to know when they're having a bad day or when something's wrong, and to have the courage to not walk by that person, but to stop and ask them if they are okay to put your arm around them and escort them when need be, when they are unable to or unwilling or unable to get help for themselves. So remember today the importance of caring for yourselves and caring for each other. We have tables set up here, people with orange shirts on either side. Go see them and get more information on the suicide prevention and awareness events that we have ongoing on the installation at all times throughout the year and in particular this month. And then join us on the 28th of September from 9 to 12 in McGill uh, for our suicide awareness workshop. Please come out and join us at McGill on that day. And please remember and care for yourselves and our team together. We must care for each other in the interest of of being resilient in the interest of being ready and vigilant to defend our nation 24 hours a day against the threats that are very real and are out there. Whoa. 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 All right, I want to thank each and every one of you again. Uh, big day here on Fort Meade. So, President's going to be here this afternoon to help us celebrate and remember. He's going to be doing a worldwide troop talk from the defense media activity, a wonderful facility that we have over there in DMA. He's going to be conversing with 120 lucky service members uh, from among the ranks here, uh, and then service members globally, eight different locations around the entire globe, video streamed in, webcast in. So uh, if you are not lucky enough to be one of the 120 service members that are going to be in DMA in the audience, or the service members that will be in uh, his follow-on engagement at Cybercom and the NSA with Admiral Rogers and the team over there. Uh, go to our website today. It'll be broadcast on Armed Forces Radio Television Network services and webcast across uh, across the internet. So links are up at the gate. So we thank you. Big day here on Fort Meade. Every day is a big day here on Fort Meade. 
our nation's senior operational platform for cyber defense, the 21st century domain of human conflict and competition that we all defend and protect our nation against every day, along with the hundreds of other vital national security missions that every one of you and all of our partner tenant organizations on this installation perform every day. Thank you for being out here today, Team Need. Remember this month the importance of caring for yourselves and caring for each other. Ask, care, assist, escort. Don't walk by a person in need. Stop and get them help. Thanks, Team Need. Let's have another great, beautiful, sunny, dry day on 4P. A lot nicer than the last time we did this run. Oh, oh. Oh. All right. Commanders, take charge of your troops. Fall out. Let's have a great Team Need day. Oh. Oh.